Hello fellow thinkers and welcome to Things I Think. So today I'm going to update you on my exes, the ones who I had all over YouTube at one point or the other. Let's of course start with the most recent, um, Lauren. She is doing pretty good so far as I know. Uh, student teaching and having a thing with a girl, it's unlabeled. Um, I'm not going to say the name of the said girl. Um, but they seem to really dick each other, and from communication of what we have had, seems pretty happy. Um, Perry. Perry has undergone testosterone and has, like, a stubble, maybe a beard even. Um, really masculine looking, looks really good. He's, he's a very attractive man now. Um, I don't know if you remember him when... He was a she dating me <laughs> uh, Perry time. You'll see it. there's a whole like playlist with Perry in it. Um, and me. I'm actually currently dating someone. This person is in the Marines and is currently remaining um, unmentioned. Name unmentioned. But I'm pretty happy. You know, everything works out how it should. And... Some people are afraid, you know, they'll hold on to relationships so hard thinking that they'll never find something else. But you don't know something better may come around the corner. And just because it's different doesn't mean it's bad. It could be something amazing. And everyone around the board seems to be pretty happy. There was a time when I thought I couldn't live without Perry. I thought I couldn't live without Lauren. And now I'm happy. And the one's happy, and Perry appears to be happy. We don't talk too much. But from what I see and the life changes that he has made, he looks like he's doing pretty dang good to me. Um, Shelly, she was only on here a couple times. Married with a child. That's about all I know. Um, she was her own story. <laughs> but I'm just saying that relationships end, and people get so scared that they won't find something again. But look at me. I dated a freaking married couple for like a hot second. It was like less than a month. Maybe 30 days max. 31, 32. Um, and now I'm in a relationship. It's fairly new. Like 48 hours new. So I'm not going to mention much about it. I don't post on Facebook about my relationships until one month in. So I'm going to do the same with this one. Because it means something to me. Um... Anywho, that's all I think for now. My message is hope, and if you don't find the one right now, it's okay, no matter what age you are. There's another one out there. Someone could be your one, and that might be your one for your 20s, one for your 30s. Then you might find someone that's the one for the rest of your life. But the person you'd pick, I don't remember what we heard this out of, but the person you'd pick when you were 15 is not the same person you'd pick when you're 20, 30, 40, 50. Different stages of your life, you pick different types of people. And sometimes you outgrow the person that you picked when you were younger. And that's what happened with me and Lauren. And that's what happens in relationships in general. So this is my message to you, is that happiness is out there. No matter what you are going through. I'm a big believer in online dating sites, which we will get to. Alright, like and subscribe for more.